didn't get it cleanly, tied up by Rubens. Victor Mete back across, and here's Robertson scores! Nick Robertson posted in, and he has goals in back-to-back -back games. And here's an interesting line. We saw the chemistry between Holmberg, Mulgan, and Nyland. Not 88, it's 89, and Robertson coming off of a goal in his last game early on in the first there. Does an excellent job of the adjustment of watch this pass. It's a little bit to his left. He's got to reach back for it. Great screen in front by Holmberg. And Forsberg never really saw that one, but another good example of just the quick wrister. And so often it's just the positioning of that shot. That's an off the post and in. That's a good feeling for a young shooter. With the Maple Leafs, and Hans Mike called him the greatest captain in Leaf history. Yeah, such a great legacy, and it's just amazing to see his granddaughter. Here's Aston Reese in, Forsberg, and the rebound scores! Bobby Kubel cashes, and it's 2-0 Toronto. Offensive-minded line in this Kachuk line going back the other way. You got a three-on-two, and this is just a simple play. Puck towards the net there, creating a rebound. Forsberg able to get a piece of it. But going in on the doorstep, the play was made by Hall down low. Camp does a nice job of just sifting it into the middle and then right on the doorstep for the rebound. I think Kubel with his first as a Maple Leaf. Logan Shaw took it away, kept in by Rubens. Got a man in front, but the pass doesn't arrive on the stick of Lucini. And Wayne Simmons on a solo mission will hit down. Logan Shaw follows up and gets a hit of the fortune. Scores! Victor Mente with a blast. And the Leafs have three before the midway mark of this first period. It just separates him from the pocket. Dump in by Simmons. Both players coming in trying to get a hit. And this is coming off the bench and right down center. Puck rolls down into the Ottawa zone. And this one is done. And the Leafs move to three and one. In the preseason, the Senators now one and three. But maybe more notably with the players who are in the lineup for the Maple Leafs in this game is quite intense and Wayne Simmons noted. Chance in front scores! And Parker Kelly has Ottawa on the board with 27.1 on the clock. Simple dump in that they retrieve. This is one that Samsonov has to have. Instead, he lets it go by. He's late getting there and just an excellent play to get in there quickly. Kelly's got a nose for a net. He gets inside instead of going too far. Stops up. And nice job on the doorstep. Josh Norris back to the point. Shabbat. Stutzl on the near side. Good looks already on this power play. It's Thomas Shabbat. Norris. Down low, scores, and it's a beauty. Frank Batherson from Kachuk. Thing up on the board, but it's the execution that's important. You get crisp passes through a seam, up high, to the side, and just watch how quickly this is on and off the stick of both Kachuk and then the quick release in the back of the net. Batherson gets himself settled and gets it up into the top corner of the net. I mean, that's just a quick delayed play that's too fast for the stick of Hall. That pass just failed to get to the stick of Hall. Justin Hall behind the net. Up top crawl, one-timer, Robertson off the post, scores! Logan on the rebound, and the Leafs have a two-goal lead. And the Nick Robertson shot continues to be a fact. In the first period, a quick release. This is just Justin Hall making a little bit of extra time, but this is just a bomb right through the traffic in front, right behind and on the doorstep. Malgan. So this is made possible. I showed you earlier the opportunity for Vill William Villeneuve. Not sure if Mete's been back since we saw him go up off a little uncomfortably. Robertson in the slot, scores! Nick Robertson's got a pair and has become a story in camp for Toronto. And talk about trying to make an impact. I mean, this has been a kid that you've been watching the last couple of years say, what can he do to find a way to stay here? And that's a goal scorer's goal. Reaching for the puck, directing traffic where it's going to be. And when he ends up getting it on his stick, that's what his strength is.
gets feet in the neutral zone, dumps it in, gets a little bit of a fortuitous bounce, but look at that movement and the quick release. 5-2 down in the game, and they have Forsberg on the bench, and a puck sent 200 feet, and Justin Hall puts one in. That'll be the longest goal for yeah. a Leaf this year. ...worried at all, and... Paul just takes matters into his own hand. You know, great job of winning the faceoff, though, and that's the key. There's Logan Shaw, a right-handed faceoff man. You remember Jason Spezza gone. You don't have a righty in that role, and Shaw snaps it back and gets a fist pump from Hall. Without a goal allowed until tonight, Samsonov now two goals against in five periods of play. Unless Crookshank can score him. <laughs> the announcer's curse. And yeah, I guess it works in the preseason, too. Back-to-back -back preseason games. And this one will bother Samsonov because it goes through you. That's the one thing as a goaltender. A little turnover under that pressure. Bouncing puck all around. Crookshank just throws it to the net.